Hey, what's good? It's your boy, Mr. Wonka7, back again with another update video. March was not what I expected. I was expecting a little more political shit. But it doesn't matter. I did an autiste this week, seeing as it's Monday. It probably just dropped. I checked it. It's been like three hours. It did drop. I don't know what I'm saying. It was pretty good. It was pretty funny. I didn't have just one autiste segment on the Daily Showa. I had two. I'm going to be back on that shit, preferably next week or the week after. So, if you're down for that, you know where to find it. The right stuff dot biz, that WordPress shit. Another thing, I have a new like page. Well, it's actually six months old. Called Fresh Prince is the best anime. It's kind of like. King of the Hill is the best anime, or what's that bullshit? Cory in the House is the best anime, but only this was my inside joke. This was my way of shit posting, and I'm just sharing what I think is funny and pertains to Fresh Prince. I'm not really drawing too many anime things. I'm not gonna force it. I would like to if I was more creative. If I was actually a better memer. But instead, I'm just sharing random stuff. And it's actually getting a lot of activity now. There's like a new like every day or every 12 hours. That's some that's some crazy shit. And I'm not even on it like that. So I guess a lot of people do in their heart of hearts agree that Fresh Prince is the best anime. And they're right. And they're right. Another thing. There was a flash sale on PSN, and the games that were available, there were a lot of games available, 90 cents. Not even, less than a dollar, 90 cents, 92, 93, it was arbitrary at some point, but cheap ass shit. I was able to secure myself Wild Arms 1, Wild Arms 2, and Breath of Fire 4. I could have, since you need like a minimum purchase of five dollars, so I should have probably bought like two more things. But I didn't know about this rule; I didn't pay attention. I could have got myself Mega Man X Four and X Five, but I've played those games so many times as a youngin that while it wouldn't have cost me an extra cent, eh, I don't really. I'm not gonna lose sleep over it. Because I wouldn't play it anyway unless the sale was involved. This, on the other hand, I loved Breath of Fire 4. I had forgotten how much I loved this game. How much I loved Breath of Fire in general. I know, like, 2 was my shit. And this was, like, what brought me to Breath of Fire in general. I never played the other, two, the other three games. But this shit was dumb good, like... I'm playing through this right now, and I'm thinking, this is motivating me to play Final Fantasy X too, because X do some some days I, don't, I feel kind of iffy, but then I think, all right, do like one or two hours of X2, and then you can go and do your Breath of Fire Four. I do that, and then Breath of Fire Four, I'm like, hell yeah, this is my shit, and I like both games, but I love Breath of Fire Four. Wild Arms 1, however, I got into Wild Arms because I bought a dem. No, I traded Dragon Ball Z Budokai for the PS2 for a demo disc of like late 2002 games for the spring. Not spring, fall. I know that sounds stupid, but I ended up thinking it was worth it because the demo had like Wild Arms 3. And you had like three different scenarios, and all of them seemed kind of cool and fun to play. So I'm thinking, hell yeah, I'm gonna get on that Wild Arms 3 shit. And that's what I did. So I got myself Wild Arms 2 after watching White Mage Serenia's Let's Play. One month after that. Wild Arms is a really good game. Um, I only played 20 minutes of it, and I'm thinking, damn, this is. 
Like, even my bro was feeling it. He was riffing the shit out of it and talking shit about how old it looks because it's from 1996 where they were just getting into 3D. But no, this was, like, some good shit. The music is over the top. Visually, the anime cutscene in the beginning is second to none. So that was good, and I can't wait to focus more on that once I'm done with all this other bullshit. But Wild Arms 2, on the other hand, uh, the anime cutscene in the beginning, you gotta start a new game to watch it, isn't nearly as good. And while well, graphics wise, everything's kind of improved, it's gonna take a while for me to really get into Wild Arms 2. I should focus more on everything that's on my list right now when I get my headphones seeing as it's going to be April in a day when I get some headphones for my own I'm going to start live alive I'm going to start that game because that game I can go through like it's nothing like it ain't shit because it's a 10 hour game if you rush it and it's 15 hours if you take your time or 13 and a half hours if you take your time so I could probably do live alive in a couple of sessions and I really want to touch on that game it will be the first square game I've played with no involvement from Hironobu Sakaguchi not even a bullshit fake ass exec producer role you know you know, that's like, he didn't do shit. That's like a hands-off, laissez-faire-ass role, unlike producer. Exec producer? You a laissez-faire-ass dude. Lazy fair. But not nah, that was like... Romantic Saga 3 and Romantic Saga 2 when I get to that. But this shit? This shit gonna be fire. Like, live alive. And then I'll do... Rudra no Hiho, Treasures of Rudras. I still haven't come, decided which name I'll use. And that shit has no involvement with Sakaguchi either, but... Fuck it. I'm the realist right now. Anyway. One last thing. One last thing. Yeah, but damn, there's a... There's a little on my plate right now. There is a little on my plate. Yeah, well, fuck what... I'm not going to do that typical thing where I take 15 minutes to remember what was in my head. It doesn't matter. I got a lot of bullshit on my plate, but... And, you know... Me trying to get out of the neat phase. Yeah, I'm getting close. I'm getting close, motherfucker. There's a lot of bullshit, and I'm kind of hyped. Well, I'm not really. But I figured I'll make a video, and then probably make like a bullshit political video afterwards. This has been your boy, Mr. Wonka7, back again with another vlog classic. How long, much is it, long has this been? I don't know. Yeah. 8 minutes and 35 seconds. Damn. This was actually kind of compact.